I just get the fuck up. Alright, fuck my helicopter, I guess. What's up, everyone, and welcome back. So, there's two new free cars online. You got the Grotti Brioso 300 and the Dinka Vita Classic. Um, if you guys are wondering why these are free, it's because GTA released a heist event for us as a community to do, and we ended up actually um, completing it. So, in um, rewards for that, we all, we end up getting these two free cars. They are limited time though. The Dinka Vita Classic was from the 18th to the 21st. So, if you guys missed out, you guys will have to pay the 895,000. Um, but as you guys can see here, I got mine for free, just like the Grotti Brioso. Um, that one's free for, I believe, the event week this week. So if you guys haven't, definitely claim that so you guys can get your free car. I know a lot of people are really looking forward to this this car right here because they were um, referring to it as the, the Luigi car from the movie Cars. So um, a lot of people are really happy that it was free. I mean, for me, it's not really a big deal. If this car wasn't free, I most likely would not purchase it. The other car that was just released is the Grotti Itali RSX, which is the now most expensive sports car. So this is a car I most likely will be purchasing in the upcoming future. If you guys want to see a, a video on that, I can definitely do that. Oh my god, there it is. Look how cute it is. Yeah, it feels weird driving around the middle of the street in a go-kart and a wolf mask, but send it. Okay, overall, I will have to say that it is a really pretty fun vehicle. So if you guys definitely can get it for free, 100% would just throw it in your garage and if you use it a couple times it's whatever but acceleration is like eh, it's pretty bad i mean it is a go-kart but it's overall pretty bad i like how you can see the actual rotor spinning in the back you guys can see right there a little red uh, that's the caliper there so but you can actually see like it's spinning so it's kind of legit um overall yeah it's pretty fun like i said the acceleration is pretty bad but top speed is decent um, handling is also pretty decent so yeah overall fun car Jesus Christ. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. That's fun. Here. This is for you, sir. So next we have the Brioso 300. Um, this thing is also pretty fun, too. It's um, The way it handles, it kind of spins around and not... Um, so it's definitely... none of these. Neither one of these cars are really like competitive or going to be used for racing, obviously. Um, but, you know, they're just fun cars to kind of mess around with. They could probably... Um, also customize these cars to make them look funny and stuff so i'm gonna go hop in the mod shop with this and show you guys a little customizations it has okay so just everything you got like the armor okay here we go uh, reflectors you guys can take off like the little chrome stripes brakes bumpers uh, move the bumper that looks pretty clean basic classic retro that also looks pretty clean too rally lights Mm -hmm. It's a little bit too much going on for me, but for the rear, you can remove it. Basic, classic, and retro. I think the retro is probably my favorite. I'm not going to customize this because I'm not really going to waste the money. But, um, oh, I really like this. You can change the engine. That's really sick. I wonder if that does any performance. Um, helps the performance at all, but that's really, really cool that you guys can do that. I wish they would start doing more of this for other cars, like you could change the engine in other cars, would be awesome, but um, here we got the tunes, just like every other car. Um, exhaust here, pretty basic so far, just twin, single, rally, and blast pipes, okay. Um, plastic arches, carbon arches, <laughs> Could you imagine carbon fiber in this thing out, dude? That'd be... So we got the hood rack, since the hood is in the back. And the trunk is up front in this car. Propped hood. Oh, that's really sick, especially if you change the engine. Oh, that's clean. That's real clean. Might have to customize this. Literally, just so I can put that on there. Headlights. Normal everything. Um, liveries, or liveries, however you guys want to say that. Um, I don't ever put this stuff on i usually always keep my cars just a simple gray but um so we got the plate well, might as well just the plate on there so respray roof top down okay roof rack luggage full top down okay so roofs are kind of eh and sold it <laughs> imagine you got it for free and sold it but um, 
sun strips. Okay. Oh wow, they added another suspension to this. It usually just ends it. What competition? I think, and they put a race suspension on here. So that just lowers it way down. Transmission trunk. Just secondary color and then carbon. Okay. So pretty basic wheels. I think the wheels look funny because they're small. So like, they're yeah, they look pretty cool. I don't know, dude. I had to customize this one because I think this thing would look pretty cool. Just look at how small they are. But um, yeah. So basic wheels, windows, tin it out. That's pretty cool. All right. All right, boys. So there's a quick look at the, the new Freak vehicles in GTA: the um, Vito Classic and the Brioso, the Grady Brioso. So I hope you guys liked. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe. Really appreciate it. it. Really helps me out. Um, I plan to keep on cranking out videos as long as you guys keep watching them and enjoying them. Thank you guys all so much for the support. We should be hitting about 300 subscribers right now. So that's amazing. Uh, thank you guys all so much again. Um, until my next video, I'm out.